hey guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video you're going to learn how to add end screen to your video with your mobile phone and your desktop so end screen is uh, that YouTube feature that appears in the last 2 to 20 seconds of a video just like this one let me play it yes just like the one you see in this video yes it's just like this one this is called the end screen so end screen can actually aid your channel optimization because it's more like you're directing the viewers to another video and that's another way of holding your audience retention you can use end screens to promote other videos like this one, maybe a merchandise or even a website. So in this video, I'm going to teach you how to do that with your mobile phone. So as a YouTube, I'm sure you know what a YouTube to do is because if you own a YouTube channel, you should have a YouTube studio. But instead of us to use our YouTube Studio app, we are going to be working with our Google Chrome. I know that a lot of people find it difficult, especially when you go to Google Chrome and type in YouTube Studio, it takes you back to the app on your phone. And going back to the app on your phone, you will not be able to add end screen. So we are going to learn how to do that today using Google Chrome on our phone okay so to do that we have to head over to google chrome on your mobile phone and once that is open you type in youtube studio desktop desktop sites and then it's going to open like this bringing up YouTube studio as the first option don't click on it because once you click on it it takes you back to your mobile phone app the studio in your app, mobile phone so what you have to do is to press and hold the YouTube studio it's going to pop up like this and then you click on open in new tab so the tab is opened on your background all you have to do is to click here depending on the type of phone you're using mine is Android if you're using an iPhone I think there should be a plus sign at the bottom of your phone so once you click on it You can see the new tab it's here so you tap on it and then it brings you to your YouTube studio on desktop but first if you have not logged in before it is going to show you the option to either choose to return back to your YouTube app or to continue on the desktop so I I have already opened it before that's why it took me straight to the YouTube desktop. So once you're in here now, this is your channel dashboard. Click on the content. That brings up all your content. So to edit your video now, you either click on the topic or the pencil icon. And then when you're in your uh, inside your the video or once you open the video sorry then you can be able to edit your details the details of the video 
so because we are going for the end screen and the cards and this video is already uploaded to YouTube so there's no option for the next button if it is a new video there will be uh, a next button where you would be clicking until you get to this point where you would add the end screen and the cards so because the video is already uploaded the end screen and card is on the first page so you click on the end screen it brings you here so here you can be able to make changes to add the end screen you click on this plus button the element and then you see the option to either add a video a playlist or a channel so I added a video you can also choose a video you can also um, choose the option for YouTube to recommend the best for viewers or you can select a video that you want and then once you place that in here always remember to click on save button to save your work but because mine is already there there's no save option so unless I make some changes then I can be able to save again so that is that for end screen this is the end screen here you can either make changes or correct it or add more things this is the end screen you can see the end screen here you can also reposition them okay so for the cards this is the card for example for example this is one of the examples of a card a video card this pops up uh, yeah they pop up I think between uh, the 2 to 20 seconds of the end of the old video so to change it or to update it you click on the plus sign and then it brings up a video playlist or channel and then you can select if it is a video you select the video if you if you have a playlist you can select a playlist and that will be shown to your viewers at the end of your video so if you would like me to teach you how to or to make a video on how to create a, or put your videos in a playlist leave your comments in the comment section and then I will make a video on that so once that is done you click on save and that's it for your end screen and cards very important very important yes this is how to do that and once you're done you click on save you save your changes and your end screen and cards will be added to your video So to change your end screen on your laptop, you want to head over to your Google Chrome and type in studio.youtube.com That takes you to your YouTube Studio dashboard. Secondly, you can get do by clicking on your profile picture on the top right corner of your YouTube page and find the option YouTube Studio and once you're in you want to go to content click on the pencil icon or you click on the title of your video and once you're here here is where you can edit and change the details of your video. So to add your end screen, because the video is already uploaded or you're about to upload it, if you're about to upload the video for the first time, 
you will see the option for next and then you'll be clicking the next until you get to the last page where you can add the end screen and the cards so but because this video is already uploaded you have to go down here where you can find the end screen click on the pencil icon it takes you to the end screen you can choose the element that you want to youtube to show to your viewers you can either choose click this um, element and then you can see the options if you want a video to display between um, 2 to 20 seconds of um, the ending of your video you can choose a video you can choose and then you come to your video and select the playlist you can also choose a channel if you want to you can choose and then you update make sure you click on save once you update these details so I'm not going to be saving because um, I've already uploaded this video so I'm just going to click on this card this is it for end screen and so for the cards you come back here click on this pencil icon it takes you here and then you click on this plus icon you can also select either a video like this one here this one here it's a video if you want a playlist click on it and select the, the playlist or a channel and then you have the option to customize um the message that you want the viewer to see and the title of the video and then once all that is done you click on save okay so end um, screens and cards are very important to your video because it helps your viewers to you know um, to be able to see the next important video a video that might interest them because YouTube will um, push out the videos that are best for each viewer so once you put the end screens and end cards it will be able to help you push out more to get more views because you don't know who might want to watch the next video so that is why it's very important it keeps your viewers engaged when you have end screens and cards in your video so i think you've learned a lot from this video as we're going to round it off from here so please if this is your first time coming to this channel don't forget to comment don't forget to subscribe and like the video i'll see you in my next one bye